Hey, how y'all doing? It's Roger Cook, aka DJ Cook em Up, and welcome to another edition of Louisiana Unleashed. Today, I got Leo Tate, the CEO of Blue Star Productions. Welcome to the show, Mr. Leo What's up, Tate. Right? Man, how, how you been? Know. In a while. Same old, same old. See, I've been working with the I Believe movement, the, the uh, I Believe song with Lil Cali, man. What, what, what you, what do y'all got for the, uh, the, uh, the movement, the I Believe movement? What's, what's going on with that? Tell us a little bit about that. Uh, well, the the girls and Lil Cali have been performing in different schools. Yeah. Uh, we made a arrangement to do a bunch of the their graduations for the schools for the kids. And in return, like we're getting a big response from some of the principals and different things wanting us to come perform for the entire students. Okay. Okay. So what gave you the idea to do the, the song with Lil' Cali, the, the I Believe song with McKenna and Cap? I mean, what, what, what inspired you to do that? Uh, me and Lil' Cali, we go way back. We went to school together, graduated from high school together. Right. And from seeing my daughter come home, my son come home and, and complain about these kids bullying right. and you know being picked on for this or for that reason, it was a motivational factor until me being able to say, okay, let's write this song this way, let's do it this way. And I just felt like Cali would, would be a perfect fit for the song. Okay. Okay, you, got, you do you think you're gonna have any more collabs for the, uh, the project? I know this is a single, but I, I, we're talking, I think y'all putting together, uh, I believe, uh, anti-bullying album. Correct. Do you have any more uh, collabs you're going to do with anybody else? Oh, definitely. Okay. Definitely. The, the res respond to the song, is it picking up or is it, I mean... You know, that's the funny thing is that it's actually picked up big time to the point where we're getting responses from all over the world. Really? The song. Yes. We okay. get responses from everywhere. Okay. And you, you put it, you just have it on... Uh, you have it on iTunes yet? You haven't put it on the iTunes? Uh, Actually, it, we just made it available for download for people to be able to buy and okay. on various distribution, digital. Okay, digital downloads, cool. Uh, so this song, I, I mean, everybody loves the song that hears it. So uh, if, if you haven't heard the song, you need to go hear it. The, the name of the song is Believe, right? Believe. Now. Believe. And it's featuring Lil Cali. And it's, it's on iTunes now. and. and a lot of digital downloads, uh, the work, the work, the work behind these products. And we do a lot of uh, interviews where I like people to express how much work this is. I don't want to sugarcoat it. Just tell them how much work this is to actually get stuff like this done. Because everybody try it and it's when it, when the, it gets on their back. It's, it's a lot of work. It's a lot of work. It's a, it's a full job. It's doing multiple things at one time. It's no just sitting here wanting to not promote yourself. You want to get somewhere, you have to promote yourself. You have to be able to find people that you can trust to help you do it. It's non-stop. That's a fact. How hard it is to find people you trust? That's a very hard <laughs> yeah. deal. Yeah. That's a very hard deal to find people that you can trust. It's, it's one of those things. Right. So if you want to give somebody some advice, if they had this on their heart to do a, a, a production company, a label, a producing artist. I mean, what advice would you give them to, to actually partake in something like that? First of all, it starts with the dream. You have a dream, you have a vision, you can do anything and believe anything that whatever you put your mind to, you can accomplish no matter what nobody says. It's hard work, it's not easy, but you can do it. Building a team. That's harder than, I mean, I, I, that's super hard. Like building up a reliable team. I mean, what would you suggest them to just go out and find a team or go out and let the team come to you? Definitely just st stick within the circle of the people that you trust. Trusting somebody makes a difference in everything and every movement that you make. You don't have to always depend on everybody else to do everything for you. Sometimes you got to stay in your spot and let God take you the way he's going to take you. Okay. So back to the, the, the I Believe movement. I mean, what, what do you think? You're going to take this to the, 
to the highest level you could possibly take it. Because it's, it's, it's sizzling right now in, in our parish, which is Tangsville Parish and, and surrounding parish, it's really going. But you said they have people from overseas and that's, that's liking the song. Uh, so you thinking about seeing McKenna overseas soon? What I'm thinking about doing is turning this, this, the local project into a worldwide project, which including tours and different artists. And I'm thinking about turning into a bigger than life project, basically. Okay, it, I mean, uh, I know you have something to say to the parents. Let's talk to the parents about this anti-bullying. I mean, just for, for, I mean, you don't have to go in depth or anything, but just, just give them some insight, sir, because this, this is really, really serious. The anti-bullying is real, real serious. Um, for as parents, the, the kids start at home. The training starts at home. A lot of the things that I see and a lot of things that I hear that my kids go through is because of things that they heard their parents say or seen their parents do. It all starts at home. If it, as a parent, if you can't discipline your kid or you can't correct the problems, because a lot of these kids are harming themselves or want to end their lives because of the next kid saying th something about them. So it all starts at home when you're talking about kids that want to hurt themselves or kids picking on the next kid okay. because they can't get the same kind of shoes or right. afford the same kind of house. So we should, the parents should get more involved when the kids activity that come home and ask you how you did, what, what, what happened at school, was anybody picking on you, or did you pick on anybody, or don't pick on anybody? Or it it definitely kids? starts with a, a communication between the parents. Okay. Uh, the communication between the parents and the kids have to be where the kid is able to come and talk to you and say, look, mom, dad, this is what such and such did to me, and that parent needs to take responsibility and go to the school or go to whoever, whoever they need to and, and show the kid that they can trust them to try to take care of the issue. Right. So maybe we need to get together and, and, and teach parents or give, give counseling to parents. And we need, need to do that with this uh, uh, I Believe movement, the Believe movement. That would be, I think that would be something to look into. But, so you think it starts at home with your parents, uh, discipline your kids, finding out what's going on, and all that. Okay, cool. Yeah, I, I de definitely believe that it starts there. It okay. starts at, at, at home. Uh, the kids pick up a lot of things from home. I don't care what it is that you do, the kids pick up a lot of things from their parents. Right. Whether it's the language, whether it's the movements, whether it's the way they wear their clothes, whatever it may be, they pick it up from parents. Right. So you got to be careful what you're doing as a parent around an influential kid, in other words. I mean, Correct. Drinking, Correct. smoking, cursing, fighting, all, yeah, not five feet. So let's 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 get on this movement with the anti-bullying and let's start as parents. Let's start at home with this also and, and give. Okay, parents, we need you to take a, a an initiative to help McKenna and Heidi with this uh, believe movement, the anti-bullying movement, and we appreciate you, Mr. Leo Tate, for jumping out there and giving us some kind of guidance to this, man. Uh, it's very appreciative, man, because like I said, some of us didn't even know this was going on. So, this has been Louisiana Unleashed. We appreciate you for coming out. Blue Star Production, uh, Mr. Leo Tate, and the family, man. It's, it's a, it's a real, it really, it's a family movement. I mean, we all a part of it, so y'all enjoy it. Thank y'all. See y'all next time. Peace. I'm not going to